guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Alice and on this channel, we review all the most popular activewear brands that you can find either online or in stores. And today we are going to be doing a quite an extensive review on the different brands that you can find on Amazon, specifically the activewear brands. And so before I get started, just reminding you, if you like this video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. If you want to see more content from me, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And lastly, all the um, items that I've tried on today will be linked in the description box below, including my own personal measurements. So without further ado, let's get right to it. All right, my loves, this is the first set. It is by the brand Sportnier in the color silver blue, and I'm wearing a size medium, and this is $34.99 Canadian. So this is what the sports bra looks like on. And then here is the back. So as you can tell, this is actually a ribbed material. It is a one shoulder. It is also very, very um, stable. So even though it's one shoulder, I don't feel like this is going to fling off if I'm trying to do my workout. And I really appreciate how there are removable cup pads. Not only that, they also have a stitch lining inside um, the sports bra so that, for example, if you're a girl, you know what I'm talking about when I say when you throw your sports bra into the wash, what tends to happen is your pads either get moved. So maybe you have two pads on each, one pad on each side, one pad will actually travel to the other side and you'll have either double pads on one side and no pad here, or your pads will just be kind of all the way up here or somewhere down here. And this tends to happen with sports bras that don't have a very lined um, stitching inside to kind of split the pads apart but with this sports bra you don't have that issue it has that stitching so when you do put it in the wash you take it out it will still be in its place the thing that I realize about this sports bra is that it doesn't really have a waistband um, it's very very thin and very Mm, it's not as tight as I would like it to be, but it's not a big deal. If you're just looking for a sports bra and nothing that really cinches in your waist, then this would be a pretty good sports bra to go with. And I also do really love the color as well. So this is what the legging looks like on me. So before I get started, I do want to mention that there is a line that kind of runs down these leggings and that just tells me that these leggings have been folded in a particular way in the package for a while now. So in order to get rid of this line, all you really have to do is take your leggings to the wash. So that is not a big deal to me. A few things I do want to mention about these leggings is that number one, you don't really have a camel toe when you wear these leggings which I truly appreciate because with a lot of seamless leggings like this one, you will normally get a camel toe when you put them on. But with these, but, but with these ones, we're good to go. The next thing I do want to mention is that there is a different type of fabric um, all around these leggings. So it is a ripped material right here. Oh, my nails kind of match. And then the like the part of the leggings on your thighs and in the back it is a smooth material so it's not ribbed like it is right here and the ribbed material runs all the way down to the very bottom of these leggings also these leggings are squat proof <laughs> yeah okay and these leggings fit so comfortably on me the, the material, the texture, everything just feels perfect. Um, I really have no complaints about these leggings whatsoever. And the last thing is that these leggings do have a stitching down here where it kind of cinches everything in, in your ankle area. And I like this because it just really secures the leggings so that when you are actually working out, 
your leggings are not folding up or getting too loose. And here is the next set. It is by the brand J and Jan Print. I am wearing the color white in a size medium and it was $37.99 Canadian as well. Okay, so this is what the sports bra looks like on. Sorry about the tag. Back. So this is a ribbed material sports bra. It does have removable cup pads as well. There is a much more defined um, waist lining or under bust lining here. So it really cinches everything in and makes everything feel much more stable and secure. The straps here are from thick to thin and it goes all the way back. I love the design of this. It's kind of like a racer back, but with a hole in the middle. <laughs> Overall, I really, really do like this sports bra because it just feels very secure. And I love the color. It's very refreshing to see. And I don't think I have a lot of white sports bras. So this is what the shorts look like on me. The first thing I do want to mention is that this is, again, also ribbed material. There is a bit of an elastic band around your thigh, so it feels very secure and it does not feel like it's going to keep rising up if you're doing squats or anything like that. There, again, is zero camel toe, which is so awesome because you would think that you would have a camel toe with white shorts but this one you are good to go the band here is i think a good band um, width and these are unfortunately not squat proof so like yeah it's, it's not squat proof whatsoever but i do want to mention the fact that these Shorts do make my booty pop because it has a design right here to really contour your bum. And then it also does have a butt scrunch down the center. The only thing with these um, shorts that I find quite odd is that it actually fits me perfectly. But for some reason, this area is quite loose. I don't know if you can tell, but it is kind of loosey-goosey here. So... I don't know if it's just the material or it's just the way that these shorts are designed. It kind of runs down a little bit shorter at the back. But other than that, I love these leggings. They are very comfortable and the material is very soft. This next set is by the brand Miyoki and I'm wearing the color light orange in a size medium and this was $36.95 Canadian dollars. So this is what the sports bra looks like or sports top. And this is the back. Again, this is also a ribbed material. I do want to mention that although everything fits, seems to fit perfectly, the straps are kind of loose, so they kind of fall down on its own as you're moving around, which is kind of annoying. So I'm not sure if it's because I don't have, I'm not sure if it's because I don't have the right size or if it's just the way that this sports top is designed. Unfortunately, these straps are not adjustable, but they do really look nice on me though. And they do feel very, very secure um, in the bust region. And also um, the waistband here really does help secure everything in place. They also do have um, removable cup pads. So that's always a plus, but the only issue I have are these straps. See, they kind of just come off. So yeah, that's something I've definitely 
needed to mention. But other than that, I love the color. I love the fit. The material is nice. It's definitely not super soft, but it does feel very sturdy. So if you were to put it in the wash for a few times, you know that this top will still come out perfectly fine. All right, so this is what the shorts look like on me. Again, this is a ribbed material. And the band around the, um, where am I forgetting where this body part is called? The thighs, <laughs> the band around the thighs are uh, quite tight, but it's, it fits comfor comfortably tight. So it's not too tight to the point where you feel like your, your other part of your thigh is bulging. It fits perfectly. And there again is no camel toe on these leggings. I'm so impressed so far with my whole Amazon haul because really none of them have any sort of camel toe showing. And all the colors I've tried on so far have been pretty light colors too. The band is a good width and there's actually no butt scrunch on these leggings as you can see. And if I were to do a squat, it is it is squat proof, but I feel like because I'm wearing purple underwear or bluish underwear, you can still kind of see it a little bit, but it's not very obvious at all. So this next set is by the brand Jet Joy, and I'm wearing the color red in a size medium, and it was $37.99 Canadian dollars. So this is what the sports bra looks like on me. And again, this is also a ribbed material sports bra. It has the waist um, band right here, which is a must, I feel like personally, when it comes to buying um, sports bras or sports tops because it just makes your figure look nicer and also it does make everything feel more secure. These are the straps right here and they are adjustable so you can always make it looser or tighter the way you need them to be. They also do come with inside um, removable cup pads. And I feel like the material of this is definitely very sturdy and um, much thicker than some of the other tops that I've tried on so far. It does also have this stitching detail right here to kind of contour your top. And here are the leggings on me. This is a ribbed material. And I must say, when I put these leggings on, it was pretty hard to put on, even though they are my correct size. And that is because the material of these leggings are actually quite thick and they are definitely not as flexible as some of the earlier leggings that I have tried on in the color blue. Again, there is no camel toe on these leggings whatsoever. And the color is amazing. It does have a stitching detail that starts here and then goes down all the way to the bottom and then it does also have that same stitching detail um, with the booty area so it doesn't have a butt scrunch but it does have these linings down here let me see that right here just to make your booty pop and it is squat proof Moving on, this is by Manon Rosa. It's in the color red, even though it doesn't look like it's red. <laughs> and I'm wearing a size medium, and this was $35.99. All right, so this is what the top looks like on. And this is the back. So I really like the design and the quality of this sports bra or sports top, it is soft and thin, but also thick. So it does feel very, very sturdy. 
it does have this band around the waist region. I love this detailing right here. And these straps are actually adjustable, as you can see. But even when I do adjust it to make it tighter, this part still feels somewhat too big. So this is definitely not a top that I would work out in. Most likely I would wear it to the beach or just to like hang out with friends on a casual day, but I would never wear this to the gym just because it, the material itself um, still feels a little bit loose. And I'm not sure if it's because the sizing that I got wrong um, because yeah, it just, it is kind of not very stable on the sides right here. And lastly, it does have removable cup pads, so that's always up. So this is what the shorts look like on me. They are seamless, but this is not a ribbed material. There is a small band around your thigh region um, just to make sure that these shorts don't continue to rise up when you're working out. The band is very secure around the whole leggings. And there is no butt scrunch on these leggings. And it is squat proof. And of course, lastly, there is also no camel toe on these shorts. Overall, I do really like these shorts. They fit me perfectly. And the, the material is not too thin and not too thick. Thank you guys so much for watching. This concludes my active wear review try on haul. And if you guys have any other suggestions on different brands that you'd like me to try out, please make sure to leave it down in the comments below. And I do want to mention again that all the items that I tried on today, the links are also down in the description box, so make sure you check that out. And of course, lastly, give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed watching this video or found this video helpful. And subscribe to my page if you want to see more content from me. And on a side note, Personally, I'm going through some things um, in my personal life right now, so if I'm not extremely consistent with my posts in the next couple of weeks, please, please be patient with me, okay? So I'll see you guys next time. Happy shopping!